Okay, so here we are on our way to Amber Falls. Um, running through the forestry at the moment. We've come up that way. And you can see how the National Resources Wales has been felling all these trees. So we've got the Tuesday evening Mike Blake race coming up soon, uh, which normally goes up there. So I don't know what we're going to do this year. But there we go, devastating. Anyway, the plan is, you can see the falls over there, and the little falls, right the back over there. So our plan, mine and Amber, who you can see just popping her head up over one of the stumps of the trees, um, about 50 yards away. Our plan is to go over the scree, following the route of the Welsh 1000 metres peak race, um, over the top of the falls, over the river and then up there and then run in between Berra Bach and Berra Mawr and then in a big loop all the way around um, Droskel and Gernwigai and then this one here is called Moyle Union and we're going to come over the top of that and then down there underneath the pylons and then eventually drop back down into Abba uh, where I've parked my car so that should be fun right Okay, so we're halfway up the screen now. See the falls there, and you can hear it as well. And then all the people walking up the valley. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? Absolutely stunning. Right, onwards and upwards. Right, we're at the top of the falls. You see the falls there. Mile and on. And then back down the valley. Very, very slippy rocks here, so it's important that you wear proper shoes for doing things like this. Can't take any chances. And an emergency kit in the bag there, just in case. It's a glorious day, as you can see, but when you're going out in the mountains, especially by yourself, you need to be prepared because the weather can change dramatically without any notice at all. Believe it or not, it can be like this down here and up in the tops it can be horrendously different I've been caught out before so it's important that you go prepared some emergency food and drink and um, some waterproof or at least windproof jacket and trousers as well this is fantastic isn't it look at this just towards the top of where the waterfall um, goes over the over the edge just there so we're heading up there now yeah better back better mouth he's getting between those two so here we go I can't afford a selfie stick I have to use my arm Okay, we've just crossed the river, the river's back there down in that valley, probably can't see it very well. So you've got Schwitzmerbach and Schwitzmermau there, you've got Drim over there in the distance, you've got the Berras, I never remember which is which, is this Berrabach or Berrabach? Um I know that the, the tallest of the two is Berrabach, um, which is a bit uh, counterintuitive to call the bigger of the two the small one but I think it's small in terms of area, um, although it's higher. And we're gonna get up this blooming slope here now, jeez. Okay, it's hard work. It's obviously caught a few animals out as well, a few sheep, as you can see. A few of the sheep around here have succumbed to the conditions. Yeah, it's, um, it's pretty desolate, there's nothing around here. You don't want to get stranded here or injured here. A few wild ponies up on the side there. Excellent. Right. So, onwards and upwards it is. This slope is hard work. 
Come on, man. Up, good girl. Slippy, very boggy. healthy at all that looks injured better leave it alone number yeah right then just over the top of this hill here now yep there we are there you go the two bedders And you got Droskel there. And looking over to Myla and Yon there. Anglesey in the background. Puffin Island. Oh, Hollyhead Mountain, right in the far distance over there. Minute Tour. There's a mountain race there on the June the 10th, 2017, if anybody's interested. One o'clock start, 6.7 miles. 1200 feet of climb. Everybody fancies doing it. Look at this. That's amazing. Anyway, I'm gonna run out of battery at this rate. I don't know what that is. Looks like frog spawn. Would it be frog spawn? Some sort of eggs anyway. Because it could be. It's quite swampy here. Boggy. Boat here. Be careful, it don't stand on it. Okay, so I changed my mind. I'd rather than go through the gap between the two bedders, better back and better mouth, and around the back of better. And I've come this way. Look at that view. Oh, that's fantastic. Another, there, you've got a rail end there, got the well in there, kind of David there, and then you've got the good dead eye over there. And then you've got the snow, the massive behind it. This is fantastic. Anyway, sorry. Um, so instead of going through the gap between the bedders, I've come this way instead, straight up here. And then there's a little path for Droskel there. But I'm not going to go up Droskel, I'm going to pick up the path that, uh, if any of you have ever done the Voile Vras race, then it's the path that you uh, take on the return section. So I'm gonna find that path. I think it's just a little bit further on than this, just as you sort of dip down into the valley. Uh, and then I'll run along that path over to Moir Union. St still a little bit of snow on at Ellen. It's April the 2nd, 2017. It's glorious weather. We've had a week of good weather, warm anyway. And it's still a little pocket of snow. You can see a few there over on kind of David as well. Brilliant. Right, let's go. We are now on the last section. There's my Union. Gain. Oh. Um, seven. And you've got my Laban just over the drop, over the drop there. My Key there in the shadows. 
Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to go over Moidlinion or drop down into the valley. Um, either way, I've got to get back down into our bed because uh, that's where I've parked my car. So we'll make it up as we go along. Just see the the summit of uh, Gernwig guy there, just popping up over the grass. Brilliant, isn't it? Right. Good girl. So, come full circle, pretty much. So you can see Abba Falls and the little falls right the back down there now from the other side of the valley. Um, so basically we've ran up those trees, or what, were, what used to be the trees, then across that scree, then up there, over the top of the falls, up the valley, and then along there behind Droskull, down the front of Droskull, and up here onto Moyle Union, and then keep on going full circle around here. Um, and then drop down into Abba. Um, I think it'll be about eight miles in total. I'll have to check out my Strava after. But it's been a fabulous day, brilliant. Right. Here are the pylons I said I had to go under. Dropping back down into the village of Abba. You can see the car park over there. Uh, my car is so there's a little cafe there. If it's open, I might pop in and have a cup of tea. Support the local community. It's been, it's been good. The members enjoyed it. Okay. <clears throat> now, nice cup of tea. A sandwich and somebody waiting to have some of the sandwich from me it was 8.8 .8 miles in total and 2,600 feet of climb that's pretty good going so you deserve these now I'm gonna get stuck into these aren't we cocky dog wait cocky dog okay till next time